Hello friends, Craig Ballard, Raptors Rap Advent Calendar Time. Now I'm blanking on, on what box we're on right now. King Kong Bundy, please give me a second here. I'm trying to remember some. Oh, oh, five. Oh, apologies, King Kong. Apologies, King Kong Bundy. Five. Yes, indeed. We're on box number five. So pitter patter, let's get at her. 11 players have won the number five in Toronto Raptor history. Now, when you take a look at this list, I think we'd be on the exact same page as to who the best and most prominent number five in Raptor history was. Got to be Jalen Rose, right? I mean, yeah, we hope one day it'll be Precious Ochoa, certainly. But right here, right now, got to be Jalen Rose. Now, what is Jalen Rose most remembered for during his time as a Toronto Raptor? Oh, right. The day Kobe Bryant dropped 81 points on him. Now, that's, of course, how the story goes. That's the legend of the story. But truth be told, Kobe Bean Bryant was an equal opportunity offender that night. And the craziest thing of that entire game is that uh, Raptors coach Sam Mitchell never sent one double team all damn game. In fact, Jalen Rose actually said that Mitchell was did that on purpose. He was pissed with his team, wanted to send them a message. Wow, message received. Kobe sending quite a message himself, by the way. So that particular night, Kobe went off for 18 one-on-one -on -one against Rose. Nine, uh, sorry, 17 against Mo P, 15 in transition, 8 versus Mike James, 7 versus Joey Graham, a 5 versus the Red Rocket, Matt Bonner, you remember him, 4 versus Jose Calderon, 4 versus Chris Bosh. Even Pop So, remember Pop So? Even Pop So took a three ball to the face from Kobe Bryant that night. Now, another crazy stat for the Jalen Rose Raptors that night was with about nine minutes to go in the third quarter, Mo P hit a pair of free throws. That gave the Raptors an 18-point lead. Raptors up 18 with nine minutes left in the third quarter. The rest of the game, Kobe Bryant alone himself outscores the Raptors 51 to 33. Holy moly. Now, again, Jalen Rose has been the punching bag for Kobe's historic night, but goodness, if your entire team, <laughs> that, that's painting a picture of an entire team getting smacked. 51 to 33 to close out a game. Wow, historic performance. Check out Jalen Rose himself describing what an animal Kobe Bryant was that night. This is from Grantland. Check this out. Awesome. He was dominant over us. You know, when you're growing up and then the rim in the backyard is eight foot tall and there's one guy that could really probably dunk on the 10 foot hoop, but he's playing on the eight foot hoop. That's how he was dominant, putting a smack down on us. He really did. Is he talking to you? He didn't say a word. 